The aim of the experiment is to measure a constant velocity using a ticker timer and ticker tape. The apparatus is a trolley runway with leveling screws. It's 12 volt AC, 50 Hz power source, connecting lids, um, ticker timer, ticker tape, sellotape and a ruler. The precautions for this experiment are to clean the runway with methylated spirits to remove dust, dirt or anything that may cause friction. These wheels have special bearings, so you don't need to be oiled. The ticker timer produces 50 dots every second. Test to see whether the trolley goes at a constant velocity. It is travelling at a constant velocity if the dots are equally spaced. Ignore the first few dots and start by drawing a line on a dot, then count five dots ahead and draw a second line. The distance between the two lines is 6.6 .6 centimeters. We'll take a five dot interval further down to see if we get the same length. Draw a line at a dot, then count five dots ahead and draw another line. The distance is 5.7 centimeters. These dots are closer together than the first dots. This means the trolley is decelerating due to friction. We are going to use the force of gravity to compensate for the force of friction by tilting the runway. We need to use copies to tilt the runway a little more. The dots are now equally spaced so we can measure constant velocity. We'll draw our lines, but this time on a 10 tick interval. The distance is 12.6 centimeters. The average velocity of the trolley will be the magnitude of the displacement over the time. Uh, the time taken for 10 dots is 10 fifteenths of a second or 0.2 seconds.